Hello guys, Naya here. Welcome to the fourth episode of As Brasilia. Last time we have finished some important texts. We have uh, recovered from the unhealth that the early war has caused us. And we have placed a very nice water city near a lot of geothermal vents and a lot of lodestone. I'm looking forward to improving the city. Uh, it will produce a euphotic strand in two turns. And my main cities are building up nicely. What I wanted to do last, last episode was to declare war on Integra and take their capital wealth geist. And then, after, after that, I can move over to other enemies. I think I will leave ARC as the last one. Let's go to do this. Nova Peshawar finished the laboratory. It needs to build up a lot of buildings. Yeah, a water refinery would be nice. Santa Adria finished a pan. I will need to keep these flowing so that I um, have a decent colony health. Let's build a farm lab real quick. And this Lancer, yes. Wait, what are my diplomacy, my trades? I have general mastery, I have generous purchasing buildings and city energy yield. Uh, my city energy yield is very respectable now. I can improve it. I have full of full agreements, which I don't quite need. Get more energy yield. All right, in that case, I will mash these aliens even though they are angry at me there is nothing they can do Marvel quest going hearts and sand i need two more alien cities and i don't even know where they are one may be here in the darkness and the other probably here near lena i will wait for this battle suit and after that i can probably quickly declare war quick check at diplomacy summary uh, he's cooperating with me everyone is fearing me except for uh, Susan Fielding uh, Duncan and Samatar and Susan Fielding like me a lot nobody is doing very great in terms of affinity everybody is very balanced and very weak four affinities of all of them I have eight impurity there's the Drydox quest um I'll, have, I'll take the 10% production for naval units from dry docks. This battle suit is already seasoned. I will keep making farms. They uh, give me two additional food and one energy. Uh, right now they are a very good improvement. Let's give it one more turn. I eagerly anticipate the results of infusing additional sources. There is Euphotic Strand, which gives me one more science from each coastal terrain in the city of Boa Esperanza. I'll pillage this alien nest and move away to heal. Boa Esperanza uh, now contains uh, two wonders. The Bantic Augur, which produce, gives it uh, additional production, two production from Costern, and the Euphotic Strand, which gives it sci plus one science. My science uh, was boosted by, I guess, by eight additional science just from building this wonder and it will continue to grow it doesn't apply to the ocean this is the turn i will turn to declare war on lena ebner straight direct to war now i have i will have to move my units all around here she has some gunners my guardians are a lot stronger than their than her gunners city of eintracht will be surrounded by suits they are currently strong enough to handle the city themselves i think i should need more um, ships especially submarines to bombard the city from sea buy some and it looks like yes just about the size let's take an undertaking the kingdom as well gives three food which is huge there is a quest nostalgia trip I am proud, hopefully not too proud. 
poor Nivera should not have to take care of an old, prideful man. Ah, but I can't help myself when the next satellites are launched across the colony. We will be on our way to Earth. So there is some of our population that is traveling back to Earth. Launch three of any orbital unit. And I get three level of affinity. Let me see the affinity level first. I think pure going purity is the best here. And I can upgrade my artillery, which I do not really have. Make it one movement. It is very good to have quick uh, quickly deployable units, especially artilleries. Let's make more pans for the quest. Guardian got bombarded, but I will march the battle suits right in. And I got a progenitor one. Let's see what can I can get from Relativistic data, data bank. Wonder. Minus one intrigue per turn in all cities. I think I will take this one. I've never seen a wonder from these uh, artifacts being built. But minus one intrigue per turn in all cities, that's a very strong IRC counterplay. This submarine will bombard the alien life and get me science and diplomatic capital from it. This explorer finished an expedition, if I remember correctly, and should go over here to the wreck colony lander. I think the next one step is to build the Xenomass wells for the food for the city. So these wonders, I would call them together. Well, they can be decoupled, but they both provide yields to coastal terrain. And two production is nothing to sneeze at. Uh, I would call them the Ocean Petra or Coast Petra. If you know Civilization VI Wonder Petra, it gives really good yields to otherwise useless desert tiles. This is an early precursor to this. I will promote these guardians with new recruits just to keep them alive and pounding the city. And the melee unit can attack as well. I would like more battle suits. And Santo Adriao will build. There's no Xenomas well in this city. Yeah, let it build the relativistic data bank. I'm looking forward to to how the how it looks i forgot some units back in here and manuel could make a bionic slab to get bonus to health but it's not as big it could build better chemical plant uh, the building itself isn't very interesting but it provides but it provides yields via the quest and i will bombard this strand stranded armor Quest for water refinery, that's this uh, building that gives one production to coast tiles. It should provide one food. It's just one flat food, nothing special. Boa Esperanza should build the Guo Puyaolan wonder as well. Uh, this one is a new one in the, added in the expansion, which makes uh, the culture cost for new virtues be reduced by a percentage equal to the city's population. So if the city has 8 population, it will make new virtues 8% cheaper. If the city would be 100 population, all virtues would be free. That would obviously break the game, but it's very hard to... and takes long time to uh, get a city to 100 population. Maneuver around Eintracht a bit. This battle suit will pillage, get some little help. And all the other ones will attack the city. Um, this one will finish it. Even though this will cost me a lot, I will annex the city right now. Now, I will create a puppet and once we take out Lena Ebner, we will annex cities that we want and the rest will be just puppeted. This Lancer deserves a heal. And I'm running low on diplomatic capital because of cancelled agreements with I will heal all of these battle suits again. Buy a submarine in Nova Peshawar and Undertaker again and produce use a network.
right this sentinel has been under fire uh it will it will pick a new recruit because it is a melee unit that can tank some damage and this gunner can pillage okay she has got several gunners again this undertaker will go to fight as well and my sentinel was taken down by all the gunners that she has i obviously need more units and that's why i'm waiting for these battle suits not that they are, they are any special or any better um, than the ordinary sentinels right now the quest for bionic lab can give me one more science and one more culture let's have them unlimited use for all people build trade convoys i heard some were destroyed i don't have and the battling at weltgeist continues let's deal with this alien okay there is the city of kastan this guardian is probably dead and i have to cross all this miasma on the way there but i will bring this undertaker from the other side as well yes the guardian is down quest for pharmaceutical industry as pharma lab can give more science or more health i will take more health just to make the pharma lab just to help this sentinel can go and village a bit battle suit gets forward getting in position to attack weltgeist and so will my submarines attack her submarine tidehunter which is one um one step lower than my undertakers actually spam more battle suits this trade convoy there are several nova peshawar has two trade routes available i'm going to boost boa esperanza okay there is a narrow pass that i can slide only one unit at, at a time let's push some battle suits first Cinema as well is finished, provides 5 food and 1 energy. Should have a farm and will be almost as good as this Cinema as well right now. Cinema as well can be improved a lot more. This battle suit goes forward. This guardian can blast this marine. This marine, this sentinel is almost dead, so let's just send him out there scouting. Blow up the navy here. This guardian last city and the battle suit moves forward. Explorer should return to Boa Esperanza for more charges. All right, this sentinel was defeated by the city. This guardian will um, take out this brawler. Oh, she has, she's got brawlers already. That means she has advanced in affinity up to six but i'm absolutely dominating her at 780 war score and i will start hammering down weltgeist this battle suit will pillage and move and the guardians will each move one tile and i believe the next turn it could be ours this battle suit is damaged will pillage as expected, there is one abandoned alien city out here, near her territory. It looks like she doesn't have anything else. She got Eintracht, Castle, and Weltgeist, just three cities. Two units destroyed. Okay, there were two units killed. One of them was a battle suit. I believe that was because of the artillery in the city. And the other was the weak gunner over here. This battle suit will move simply forward. I will focus on the wild guys. The submarines first. Boom boom. And now Wild Geist is ready for the taking. It had 115 hit. There's nothing else in range. The battlesuit will have to take it. I will create a puppet of them. My health unhealth is rising or health is degrading. I'll keep building farm labs, keep improving my people's lives. Sire will get his help. Fully. Yep, that was the quest for releasing three orbital units. We are finally returning. 800 brave homesick travelers. 
We know this is a one-way journey. Who knows what will be left of Earth by the time we arrive? Nostalgia is a strange thing, but if I'm honest, I would not have it any other way. To whoever finds this journal, thank you for connecting with me. I ask only that you do the same for some other nostalgic soul. There is the culture. I got one synergy bonus from might, one from prosperity, one from knowledge. I believe I could go for either knowledge, get science and culture for all the population, or um, get this science penalty reduced, or go for plus one health for every for six population in a city. That might be cool. But I want to go for might. I could get the 50% quantity from strategic resources that will let me build more battlesuits or simply go the main route which is affinity production maintenance for units. Let's do the army engineering corps and brutal efficiency first. Interesting buildings in which are xenophil plants and xeno nursery. Xenophil plants first and I have 2000 energy and nothing to spend it on so let's buy some buildings like this like network there's some heavy fighting um my guardian was destroyed by i'm um, brawler i will have to beware of brawlers because even they die they can damage nearby neighboring units move this gunner away and destroy the alien worm her gunner yep did it do something? Did anyone see it? And let the destruction of this brawler to the submarines. The battleship heal. This undertaker can move here and explore the alien city. Which means there is only one left for the Marvel quest. And a battleship was also destroyed by enemy, man by enemy manticore. It looks like this is not a good idea to approach Castellan from the back not with a concentrated force but i can blast it and go forth with these remaining battle suits all right citadella should build up some navy i believe broadsides there is a lot of aliens which can give me a lot of science this plan will be sent to boa esperanza and my health is back in kind of normal 24 negative there is collaborative thought um, technology that is great but this wonder give let me lets me lets my military units achieve two additional levels of veterancy which means they can either heal more times during their existence or get even stronger up to 40 percent just from these from these veterans levels quest for petrochemical plants will give either culture or production to my petroleum wells i will uh, use production are a bit questionable to me I, i'm at 10 le level 10 of purity so i should probably go and get it higher i could go for aegis which uses titanium and floatstone which is a armored ranged unit very versatile very strong or on the left side there are other purity units as such as left tank which is also a mobile ranged unit and the ultimate lab destroyer let's do mechatronics and my battle suits can be upgraded at level 10 of purity and four of supremacy actually they would ordinarily need to wait until level 12 for flanking and attacking or i can get flanking and next to friendly unit or if they are not next to friendly unit with harmony i'll take the Plus 20 percent when next to friendly unit and making it uh tire two or as it says here upgrade to tire one tire zero currently it will gain 42 percent 42 melee strength and gain 30 percent when defending which is huge boost out of this number created and my prime battle suits now have 66 melee strength um, they will be able to deal with castle one single-handedly these two prime battle suits will fight castellan let's see how they fare which city would be best boa esperanza is the best city to build um, 
to build wonders in. So Boa Esperanza, the coastal, of course, of course, the coastal city with the better wonder. All right, these undertakers are not useful when fighting. Whether I should finish her off or let her on this one city, but I believe I will be able to take it even if I destroy her fully. Make an arrangement. Okay. This guardian was destroyed. Let's move our battle suits forward. This one will take out. Brawler will be taken out by the gunners. And I can see it did no damage to the battle suits. So. And destroy the alien bug as. Uh, the bug, the wolf beetle at, on the same turn. Now these battle suits can handle the city themselves. Cannot be bombarded from this side. But I can attack them in melee. As you can see, the unit has 95 strength because of virtuous combat and adjacency and everything. So does this battle suit. Which means I will attack twice and the city of Castellan is down at 28 hit points. And it will be easily taken out next turn. They even got veterans, which means I can promote them to veterans. Uh, this brawler will be destroyed by my guardians. You know what? I can delay the city by one turn and attack this brawler. I should really start working on the precog project. But not in not Nova Peshavar. This one will take the frontier state. Boa Esperanza. Right. Produce a xenon field plant. I will buy a xenon nursery and get precog. I am very surprised that my health or unhealth is currently at zero. It was like negative 24 just a few turns so before it's very surprising to me and these battle suits can actually battle the alien siege worms and defeat them one-on-one you want some peace terms uh, giving me genetic design artificial intelligence plan to survey all the useless Kind of artificial intelligence is nice, uh, but I will not take it from her. I will fuel time higher. One of our contractors at our Xenofield plant is being aggressively recruited. The other department has offered to pay us for expense for finding her. Immediately gain thousand energy or hire the contractor and give three energy and two production from Xenom as well. I never can see why anyone would take the energy instead of production and cinema energy production and energy from cinema as well as per turn thousand energy is a lot but i have many other ways to gain it and the city of castellan cannot be bombarded right now but i will move the battle suits so they attack next i will delay her existence for one possibly two more turns where where did the worm go it burrowed under the sand or something. It was surrounded, now it's gone. It's nowhere to be seen. Explorer now has five expedition modules and can last a very, very long time. Go out here and take out take this crashed satellite. I am well quest gives me two energy or one production. I'll take two energy. No. These guardians cannot fire from this side. Let's take out Castellan with my battle suits. Space Marines, go! One, two, three. And here we are. Uh, Lena Ebner is gone from... I can now take War Spoils. I will take Swarm Robotics. It gives food and drone sphere. And I will take the Artificial Intelligence. No, actually not really. I don't care about Swarm Robotics. I take Genetic Design for the Affinity and Gene Garden power systems i have a lot of geothermal wells and the rest will be capital energy you know what i could take this alien life form so okay there we go three four and this city will be popped and still i wonder how but i'm at nine positive health strange really i took a city and i got positive health some affinity in supremacy and harmony, which means, how is it called? The dual affinities. Units, I can upgrade sentinels, not to centurions, but Adalon. 
I do I really want to do it? I don't quite care. Let's make them Eidolons and go yes, kind of hybrid ability because just it's just about the units and have automatic heal. My guardians will also be uh, mixed, become virtuosos and be able to attack over terrain obstacles. We have seen just now how annoying it was if I wasn't able to do so. My ships, the broadsides, the melee ships will become barons and will be able to reveal enemy invisible units. And the destroyers, the ranged ships, uh, will become countess. And they can either move after attacking or get one range. One range is absolutely grand because I can bombard any cities from distance and they cannot do anything about it. Alright, the north is pacified. I can go on and declare war somewhere else. These battlesuits should move south. I will not bother capturing Asraya. I only really need to capture Magan. I need to capture Central. And I need to capture Deep Castle in order to finish the game. Which means I will have to declare on one war on one of them. And I think, even though it hurts me a lot, I will declare it on PIU. He's been a real friend, but this is war. I had some units destroyed. Um, titanium was released. I could build a Nana Hive. Which will dis damage adjacent units and itself is uh, invisible. You can build auto sleds, which are very fast trading and reconnaissance unit. There's another war. I have some diplomatic capital banked and will finish not yet 630 to per for this energy purchasing perk. I think I lost a lot of gunners or guardians. I should build some virtual virtuosos. I will build a growl up in Santo Adiao for the additional food and because it has fun fungus actually. These battle suits will heal for quite some time and this one will fortify. Even if I decide to attack this location, it's absolutely secured. This prime battle suit will not be destroyed by disciples, by armors, by gunners, nothing like that. At least not quickly, not in one, two, three turns. It, it, the unit will hold the position. The Space Marines are really strong. Well, tough luck, I will have just one Alpha Slut. Maybe not even that. I can... No one, no problem, no problem here. A little more Prime Battle Suits. Yeah, there is Phyrexid when I need it. There is the Precog, one, Precog Project Wonder, unless my military units achieve additional levels of currency and get stronger. Like this Undertaker, for example, it was probably at its at the maximum experience, and Baron unit is also strong and can be alert. Avatar Jamabara is going for supremacy, yellow. There is Mechatronics. And purity level 11. And the next one will be mobile lev. I get some energy from sea wells and the lev tank. My needle can be improved, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, Castellan can remove this miasma. Uh, this virtuoso need the virtuosos will need healing, but they have to cross over to here. With the virtue, I will get the brutal efficiency for a quantity of strategic resources, and I suddenly have enough titanium, enough cinemas, enough glowstone, but no pyroxide. I spent a few turns just moving builders, planning buildings, moving uh, units around, like a cloning plant. But I have enough diplomatic capital to finish my personality and get become more generous. Ah, uh, here it is, he's warning me. Reinaldo, if you ever heard the proverb, he who is destined for power does not have to fight for it. Um, then don't. I will be glad to take 
all of your cities. Left land. I don't quite like that. Make more virtuosos and purchase the left land. Yeah, building it would take a lot of time. Plan on building a lot of ships. Either Baron in two turns, Countess in three turns. Yeah, this will be a lot of ships. Move these units further into his territory. I can even move through his territory, as you can see, because we are cooperating, actually. It was not bad to trust me, but there should be some limits. He has got an aquatic city over there. Battle at Ayan will be tough, because there are only two places from which he can be attacked in melee, but Magan will be much easier. And he's got some nice wonders in there. This looks like Panopticon, this looks like the Stellar Codex, just from the look of it. Alright, I think it is time, and next turn I am going to declare war on him. Right now I was doing a lot of useless, just clicking around, moving stuff, which didn't progress me towards the victory, but I had to have my army ready. It looks like Zavanta Jambare has completed master control. Uh, that was not Panopticon, that was master control, and it will be mine if I copy. Okay, I accept your diplomatic capital. You can waste it because I'm going to attack you anyway. In relationship, I can go straight to war. Here we go. Okay, this Virtuoso will strike down the worker. Battlesuit move into position. This battlesuit will move simply forward, and I will try to destroy these these units. Ah, that was probably a bad thing to go with the virtuals of forward. How is my standing right now? Uh, I'm at war with Samata Javare, and the others fear me and like me kind of, not really. Fine. And this unit can. Attack twice? Where is it? Uh, yes, one more attack every turn from the promotion. Okay, this battlesuit will go back. It will go from the behind to Ion. I have two in front, two in the back. I'm waiting for the mobile left for the left tanks and I will be able to build them in the coastal cities and move over to attack deep cover. Okay, there was a lot of attacks on my unit over here. Yes, this Virtuoso is damaged, but it can go back one tile and some of the units. And this Battlesuit will move simply forward. These have received a level of experience and now are 30% strong. This Virtuoso will attack twice, this Battlesuit will attack once, and this Battlesuit will probably not be destroyed next turn. I think this Lancer can handle this Disciple and this Battlesuit will move forward down here to crush the... These are just armors, these are really weak units right now in comparison to the Space Marines I have. This unit will not probably join the invasion here. Okay, you can pillage a bit. Nothing was destroyed, I like to hear that. But I got veterancy, which means I can get new recruits, and this, whoop, this unit is at full strength again. And this virtuoso can attack, get permanent 10% strength, and attack the second time. This lancer will heal and go to crush this fossil, I believe. Only gunners, very weak units right now, and I can attack the city with this virtuoso twice. The battle suit will melee strike it and the city is almost down. Gain energy or one population in each of your cities. I believe the one free population in each of my cities is hugely superior to 450 energy. I should build some punishers and launch this Pion. I believe all of the Pions have gone down so I can freely place one over here in the health or unhealth meter moves a lot but it doesn't quite matter in this all right ion will be taken down soon and my southern flank can go and try to surround magan next time i will stay outside of its range for some time 
Alright, this virtuoso was damaged, but it will get 10% strength. And we'll strike Aya once and pillage the next turn. And this battle suit will attack the city. Uh, let's create a puppet. I don't really need another city. Quest Homegrown. Cena Nursery gives me immediately 450 science or plus 5 cinemas resources. I usually go for the cinemas resources, but this time I need the 450 science. And Mobile Lab will arrive in one turn. It will be bombarded by Thabo and by this gunner out there and this cruiser out there so i'm not sure if it will survive but then i can move it inside this battle suit will cut off this armor and take down this one very slowly but i'm bouncing this virtual will take discipline and move back shoot this one this battle suit will attack it and this one will keep healing at this point, I don't really care what is being built in Nova Peshara. Let's say no crawler, but use my float stone. Um, go research development. There is mobile left. And level 12 of purity. I can upgrade the auto sled, get it more movement. And next research, we go for fabrication, but I don't really need it. I need something with a lot of affinity towards purity. I need some about 12, 20 would be fine. Let's say we go for the huge guns here. Go tactical lab. Okay, this virtuoso was damaged. Um, there are a lot of surrounding units. I will shoot them down very quickly. This armor will be taken down by this weak battle suit. This one will move forward. This battle suit will go all the way to Magan, and I see he's using the station central wrong. The AI is absolutely stupid here. I need a Firaxid mine in here. Just a little bit of it. Okay, the siege of Magan is ongoing. I don't have any, really, I have any gunners to take it down, but I can move one over here. This battle suit should go to the city. This Gunner, the virtuoso will destroy this disciple. Hopefully, this virtuoso, this will keep keep healing. I will take Magan probably with the Space Marines only. Let's look at this. This Lancer will move over here. Uh, so will this Prime Battle Suit. This one move over here. You here, and I will pillage a bit. Heal these battle suits, bombard the city of Ma I will buy a unit in Boa Esperanza, and that unit will be the left tank. I will buy a left tank for 740 energy, really cheap. And let me check when does it upgrade left tank at affinity 16 or 40. But it gains only 14 melee strength and 33 range, which is a lot, but it has 44 range strength, which isn't much. But considering it's range, it's, it's very decent. A unit was killed, my lancer was destroyed. Uh, there is overseer in the village and move. And this virtuoso survived, which means he can strike twice and all of my battle suits will attack the city. Oh, bo, bo, bo. and Magan is captured. This left tank is levitating actually and can move over water even though levitating units that are not on solid ground will suffer a penalty when they are being attacked. I don't want to deal with uh, PAU anymore. I might just go and take out Thabo and approach Deep Castle or Central from but I believe that is something for next episode. Taking out two of their capitals is kind of enough for a single episode. And I'll see you next time. This is going to be interesting. Thank you all for watching. See you in the next episode. Bye.